Moved to Leeds in 1974 to become a reporter on Look North, which is the old BBC regional television station. We often found that we had Savile on our show whether we liked it or not, but we were quite often told by those on high at the BBC in London that he was a very important person, that he was uh, one of their big stars of one of their biggest light entertainment shows, and we had to do what we were told. We heard a lot of stories about Jimmy's Friday morning club, which seemed quite a, an interesting gathering that Jimmy had put together over the years. From his school friends through to prominent local businessmen and local doctors, and certainly quite a number of policemen were encouraged to go around to his flat overlooking Round Hay Park on a Friday morning where they drank industrial strength tea out of large mugs and ate very, very cheap, nasty cakes, whilst apparently kicking around the latest news and current affairs and community relations in Leeds. It was all part of Jimmy's huge sphere of influence that he had cronies and chummies in all the right places, and we were pretty sure that he may well have asked a few favours of some of those people who went to his Friday morning club. Jimmy Savile's relationship with the police was pretty curious and it seemed to go on for an awful long time. And if the police ever suspected something about some of the abuse and activities he got up to, they certainly either covered it up or they were blissfully unaware of it. Either way, they seemed to give him an ideal cloak of protection almost throughout his life.